Uh, hey, Hello. Lucas. Good so good to afternoon. talk to you in English. And it's my it's pleasure. My nice to meet you. Welcome, welcome. May I ask, where so, are you from? Uh, I'm from Russia. Please don't get, uh, you know... Uh, I really don't care. <laughs> freaked out. <laughs> Probably I'm an English teacher think. and I teach anybody who wants to learn. So welcome. I hope you're doing well today. So I hope you you too. And uh, I would like to uh, ask you about, uh, so has TikTok changed to you for the past years or not? Um, well, I've only been on TikTok for one year since I started live streaming. But I think uh, it has surprised me because I always think many people on TikTok are very childish, but it shows that we can also have actual English classes here. So that's great. <laughs> yeah, I can agree more. And especially about uh, AI, that they implemented uh, this feature in the app. Yes, so. I mean, AI is going to take over a lot of things, so we got to learn to live with it, right? Yeah, absolutely, because uh, imagine if you can make your own movie by typing a little text or maybe something like that, and you can watch whatever you want. Mm. Have you used it in any way? Uh, actually, yeah, I did. I just... Uh, uh, type uh, a message, like, uh, I mean, t a little text, and it uh, generated, uh, like, a picture, yeah, and uh, a short video, just uh, only this stuff I've, I've tried sure. so far. Just dabble in it, as we say, just try it out a little bit. Yeah, and, uh, of course, I just uh, uh, learned uh, a new phrasal word recently and uh, have you heard of uh, double back double back yes how do yeah, you use double back yeah it's just uh, when you turn and you go back to the place where you've come from yes so exactly <laughs> so just... are you using phrasal verbs often or is it difficult uh, no it's not that difficult it's just um, so fascinating for me to use phrasal verbs because they spice up my speech and they mm -hmm. like uh, like you need to use them for a change they and absolutely can and they can make you sound more like a native speaker of course yeah and uh, can you say that uh, what my what my accent is I mean, I can hear you have an accent, but I feel like your English is very clear to understand, like great pronunciation, because you're speaking oh. nice and slow, and yes. you're not using a lot of filler words. Yeah, I do my best to uh, not, you know, uh, about this uh, and stuff and using like all that thing that Sure. It just exposes me. It just exposes me. Like, and it makes English more difficult to understand, I think. Yeah, maybe some uh, some people, maybe uh, native speakers, they just uh, speak in a way that, uh, you know, one sentence uh, sounds like one word. It's definitely possible. I mean, they can speak super fast. So I always tell everybody just slow down because it's easier to understand. Yeah, obviously, that uh, from my perspective, it's uh, you know uh, essential to practice more uh, and more in uh, speaking pronunciation. Correct pronunciation is uh, the key to uh, better understanding each other. Absolutely, it is. Yes, and why are you learning English? Uh, you know, it's become part of my life. It's just uh, like, you know, just uh, my uh, first language that I use it. It's like uh, living two lives. 
Well, it is a nice language to learn, I think, and it shouldn't be too difficult for you, is it? Yeah, I I can say that uh, it was uh, when I went to school because uh, teachers don't properly uh, teach us uh, languages. Yes, it is very tough for <laughs> native Russians to teach English, I think. Yeah, 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 correct. Because they just give us books and they just tell, go on, just read the rules and show what you got. Yes, this is most schools around the world, they do it in this way. <laughs> it's always about writing, reading and grammar, but not really about speaking and pronunciation. Yeah, obviously, because they, when they explain something, they just speak uh, in, the, in their native language without exactly. uh, fully, uh, you know, diving deep into the language. Exactly. Well, it's good that you have been learning and it sounds very good. So I appreciate your trying to have a conversation with me. <laughs> like, thanks. It means a lot to me. I appreciate it. My pleasure. And I uh, hope to see you around. Hey, you too. Later.